2K Sports. It's going to be Santos. He's gone two for seven lifetime off the Cubs. This one's grounded hard up the middle. Picked up by Terrio. Over to Lee. That's one away. It's going to be Perez now. Base is empty, one out. Wells with the pitch. The 0-0 delivery, a fastball taken for a strike. A fastball up in the zone like that, a pitch a lot of guys like to hit. He just couldn't swing the bat. Here it comes. He lets that fastball go by for a called strike, 0-2. Foul straight back. Fastball got him two down. Well, the velocity getting up to about 89 miles per hour, but pretty straight pitch right there. Two straight fastballs, he still couldn't catch up with it. Well, the pitcher comes back with a fastball right after he threw one and gets the K. You know he's throwing gas out there. First one to Reyes. Here's the pitch. Oh, and and Wells has him all in one with that called strike. A good life on this fastball as he just buries it down and away. The pitch. Now swing and a shot towards second. Throws to first in time. That's three down. Three up, three down this half inning. The Cubs still ahead. It's Soriano at the plate. He bounced out his last time. Here's the first pitch. Liner between first and second. That'll put Soriano on first. That'll bring Ryan Terrio to the plate. Well, a nice piece of hitting right there. You get on base to start the inning with no outs. And you know, all it does is you want to just keep the line moving if you're the guys behind him. Runner on first, no outs. Fastball just misses. 1-0. His lifetime average, 262 against the Mets. The 1-0 now. Oh. Fastball misses badly. He's behind 2-0. On the way. Had the green light, but he couldn't catch up to it. Two and one. Well, if you're going to get a good fastball, you better pull the trigger a little sooner. You can't be late on that heater. Quick check at first. Trying to keep him close. He's back on the bag. Throws over to first. First base trying to keep him close. He's ready now, the 2-1. Terrio on a swing and a miss. That'll even up the count. Get a little extra giddy up on that one as he just blows it right by him. Oh, Soriano taking off. Now here's a grounder towards the hole. The throw. And he makes it the third with time to spare. The Cubs in a nice position to capitalize. Opposite field hitting. It is a classic piece of baseball. Especially on that inside pitch. It keeps the defense off guard when you can muscle the inside pitch to right field. And it's Derek Lee at the plate. Over his career, 2-12 oh. record against Perez. Slider just misses 1-0. 
Oh, it's a good pitch there. Tried to get him to chase it out of the zone. He just laid off. Ready with a 1-0. 1-0 oh. pitch is a fastball high, 2-0. Pitch misses, ball three. Now Derek Lee can afford, well, to pick his pitch or just take one. After another ball right there, the batter's at the full advantage. 3-0 count. I'm turning him loose right here. And he missed ball four. That's going to load the bases. He goes with the fastball on the free ball count, which is what he should do here. Be aggressive, but he throws it out of the zone, and now base is loaded. And that'll bring Aramis Ramirez to the plate. And Ramirez settles in, first pitch. Perez gets him to swing, that'll be missed and a strike. Well, that pitch right there, he just blew it right by the hitter, swung late. Here's the pitch. Ball. Good patience as Ramirez lets that one go by for a ball to count as even. A career 268 hitter against the Mets. Well hit towards the middle. It's scooped up. There's one. And two. Double play. And they bring him home. And that one's going to be a candidate for play of the week, Steve. Well, you talk about shifting momentum. You get the ground ball double play, and all of a sudden, you're back in the dugout ready to hit. And we've got Bird batting. Grounded out his last time up. And on third, two down. First pitch, here it comes. Watches that outside pitch from Perez. It'll be a ball. Well, that's where you look for a changeup from the pitcher away in the strike zone. If they look for it and get it, they can really shoot that thing the other way and do some damage. Swing and a miss. Marlon Bird can't make contact, and that will even up the count. The one thing we know is he's not going to take a borderline pitch at 1-1. He likes to swing the bat, so I'm not giving him anything too fine and see if I can't get him to hit into an easy out. Swung on, liner to right, and Terrio comes home. Boy, the Cubs are riding it along right now. They're making it happen. Oh, this is great patience at the plate. He lets the ball get deep in on the plate, comes in toward his hands, keeps his hands inside the ball, and drives it the other way. You make yourself a whole different ball player if you can take the ball the other way, as he just did. And it's Kosuke Fugadomi at the plate. Steve, we've seen them continue to charge it up at the plate, and it doesn't look like they're going to be stopped. Strike one. Oh, that last hit puts a little bit more daylight in this lead right now, Gary. They keep tacking on early. Strike, Strike two. Fukudomi is going to have to be careful here. Not a comfortable lead yet, but it's an early statement. Well, it's a statement that says, you know what? We're going to score some runs for our, our guy, putting pressure on the opposition's offense. Perez with the delivery. And it holds at 0-2. Strike two. You're out. And a swing and a miss. Kosuke Fukudomi, strike three, and he's out of there.